All right, 9A here. I think this is more of like they're trying to get you set up for um, the next, like 9B, where we're going to start to make use of looping because, you know, it's basically what we're doing through this chapter. So I think this is kind of like a problem where we're just kind of setting everything up to start and then we're going to incorporate looping into it in the next one. But it's going to look sort of like this. Uh, let's go over to the next page and check out this uh, flowchart. We've got start, declarations, four of them there. Out, uh, input account number, input your name. Um, you're going to input the purchase price of the item. And uh, we want monthly payments for two years. The book is going to have something different as far as the duration of your payment plan. I've just got two years. They might have one. I would check into that. And uh, we're going to output the account number, the name of the person, what they purchased, their total purchase price, and their monthly payment. And we're going to stop. So very simple. Uh, pseudocode, same thing. I've got account number as an integer, but I've got these two as double because I, I want to have decimal places. And then string for name. So input account number, name, purchase, monthly uh, monthly payments equals purchase divided by 24 because I'm saying you've got two years to pay this thing off. So make sure you adjust that though. And then we're going to output name or account number, name, original, you know, how much the item costs in their monthly payment. And so you can see up here, same thing. You don't have to have this code, I don't believe, but I've got this up here so I can use, like this second include here. So I can use um, the set precision because I want two decimal places. And we've got a place to ask everything. We've got our calculation here. And then we've got our outputs. So let's go ahead and run that. And uh, let's see, where is it at? Okay, here we go. I'm account number one, two, three, four, five. Name, William. Purchase price, I bought a brand new Mac, $123,000, right? Because <laughs> they are expensive, um, not that expensive, but my account number, my name, the total purchase price, that will take me five lifetimes to pay off and the monthly payment of a glorious $5,125 for two years. So each month I pay that. And that's that's pretty much it for this problem. So it's kind of simple. I think in the next one we're going to really get into it as far as looping goes. But thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.